through my head all like 24 7 the image of the little baby's foot pressing against the walmart bag i don't know i try not to judge but there's way better ways of handling not being able to take care of a baby Tonight, a newborn baby found in a plastic bag Tuesday afternoon in Seymour is alive and doing well. And we first told you about this last night on the news at 11. And today, the family who found her share with us the story of their shocking discovery. Hidden beneath the trees in a quiet Seymour neighborhood, Jesse Milligan shows us where he picked up a baby just hours old with no mother in sight. There's a little bag over there and I see a little footprint pop out. I pick it up and I untie it and I un there's a little blanket covering its face. I pull it out. I'm just, I'm holding this baby in a plastic bag just back there. An unusual sight to find in this neighborhood or really anywhere. It's something I never thought I'd see in my life. It's like really hard to believe someone just tied a baby up and left it outside. That baby more than likely would have froze to death. It's cold out. It was Jesse's mom, Angela Butler, who found the baby while walking her dog. In disbelief, she says she went to grab her son and her phone to call 911 to get the baby help. I told my boys, I said, go with me to make sure that I'm seeing what I'm seeing. And we fixed it. I had Jesse pick it up. And sure enough, it was a little newborn baby wrapped up in a blanket. With The blanket was covered his face and tied up in a Walmart, double knotted, tied up in a Walmart bag. Left alone and crying, Angela says just wrapping the baby in their arms while waiting for emergency crews to come provided some comfort to the new little life left to be found by a stranger. It was crying before we picked her up. And as we picked her, after we picked her up, she quit crying immediately. For this mother, it was a heartbreaking realization of what she just happened to stumble upon. It's sad knowing that the mother just dumped it off like it was a piece of trash. I don't see how anybody could do that to a child. Why didn't they do that? Instead of just putting it in the woods, just left it for to die. Although it was by chance Angela came across this baby, she and her family are left knowing they were able to change that baby's future. It made me feel like I saved a life today. That, that baby's got a fighting chance to grow up and just to have a life. And today, Seymour police announced they identified and made contact with a person they wanted to speak to in connection with this case. But are, we are still waiting on an official update on that investigation. And we do want to say this is a reminder that if parents or guardians are ever feeling overwhelmed, there are safe options to surrender your baby. Safe Haven baby boxes being one there. Yes, and so those are options. But the woman we talked to, Angela, was saying that she's so thankful she was happening to walk the dog because the dog is what spotted that baby too right. in the bag and alerted her to that so an interesting point there right. so just keep an eye on your surroundings and you never know what you might find we're glad, glad they were alert and we're and able to save that, save that baby's, that baby's life, life. Yeah. absolutely